Music is one of the most influential art forms on the planet. It is something that we can all connect with, and it's something that connects all of us. Studies have shown that playing an instrument can help boost motor, auditory, and cognitive skills in children. I have been playing the saxophone now for 12 years, and I love every minute of it. Over the years, I have learned the best ways to properly maintain and care for the instrument. In this presentation, I will not only show you how to assemble your saxophone, but also how to properly care and maintain it. Before we begin assembling the saxophone, it's important that we know each piece of the saxophone. Right here we have our main body of the saxophone. This is made up of three parts that are already put together. This is the bell, right here is the bow, and here is the body. It's made up of three parts. We also have the neck of our instrument, our mouthpiece, our ligature, our reeds, and our neck strap. When assembling the main body of the piece, you take the body of the horn, and you take the neck, at the top of the body there are these two screws up here. If you loosen them, it'll leave plenty of room to slide the neck right on in there. And then you can tighten those screws back up. Be careful not to unscrew the screws too much because they may come out of the hole. We can then take our neck strap, put it around our neck, and on the back of the saxophone, there's this little key ring right here. We can take the clip of our neck strap, clip it right on it. When assembling the mouthpiece, we first take our mouthpiece and our ligature and put it on so the screw is on the right side and is about right there in the middle of the mouthpiece. We then take our reed, lift up the ligature, slide in the reed going down so we don't break it, and line it up so the tip of the mouthpiece is at the tip of the reed. We then bring the ligature down and we can tighten it up. The reed is very important because that is how our sound gets made on the saxophone. We then take our mouthpiece and slide it right on the cork. If it has a little trouble going on, there's cork grease for that right here. You just put that on the cork and it'll make it easier for the mouthpiece to go on. Cork grease is toxic, so please do not eat the cork grease. There are two different types of reeds. There are cane reeds, which are the most common, and there are synthetic reeds, which are made out of plastic. Cane reeds are much better played when they are moistened before playing and synthetic reeds do not need to be moistened while they are playing, but they have a significantly diminished quality in them. Both reeds are fine, and it's up to personal preference. Now that we learned how to put our instrument together, here are some important tips to maintaining the quality of your saxophone. First off, when putting on and taking off the neck of the horn, don't wrap it all the way around. Although it can spin all the way around, it, that may bend the keys. So don't try and turn it too much. It should come out fairly easily. Secondly, it is very important to keep your horn very clean. Since we are blowing into the instrument, bacteria and debris can easily get into the horn. I have one of these. It is a silk cloth on a string with a weight at the end. What we do is we dip the weight in to the horn, into the bell, and we bring the string all the way through, and then we can tuck the cloth right in. Now the weight on the end can wrap around the horn and come out this way, and we can pull it right through, and this will clean out any debris and spit that has been left into the horn. Another important part about cleaning your saxophone is the mouthpiece. Since the mouthpiece is the only part of the horn that makes direct contact to your mouth, it is very important to keep it clean. Firstly, never leave your reed on your mouthpiece for more than you need to. When you're done playing, take it off. That can lead to plenty of extra debris and bacteria to build up in the mouthpiece. 
We also have mouthpiece cleaner that can be bought for about $5 at any music store. You just spray it on the mouthpiece. And you can take a cloth. And you can wipe it down. And this will kill any excess bacteria or gunk that is built up during your playing session. And then you could put it back in the case. There is also a mouthpiece cap that you could put on with your ligature and it'll stay nice and safe. Mouthpieces are very expensive and they're made out of plastic. So it, once they hit the ground, they can break fairly easily. So it's very important to keep that in there whenever possible so it doesn't break. In summary, we have discussed how to properly assemble the saxophone and how to care for it in today's presentation. One of the most influential saxophonists of all time, John Coltrane, once said, I think music is an instrument. It can create the initial thought patterns that can change the thinking of people. Music's influence on people is simply undeniable. Now you can be that influence. Have fun jamming.